Hello and welcome to a new video of my Unity MMO tutorial series and today we will continue with Uma. Okay, in the last lecture uh, I showed you how to create um, these sliders um, but I decided to change the hair and the skin color so I have to delete um, this tool and create yeah what we will create we will create a panel so I create a UI panel and we also add a component um, with a horizontal layout and we will put everything to five and then we will check all boxes okay and now as you can see here i will do it a bit greater as you can see here is a small panel and we changed the height of the panel to 30 and then you can see the panel and here is the game view. Um, now we can add buttons. And if we uh, drag and drop them, uh, it will be here in this, uh, in this panel. And yeah, what we will do, I will create um some stuff and we will create we duplicate um three buttons and the middle button will be empty because this will be our um hair and yeah we um change this to this one and yeah maybe we can do later here the um we can yeah we can type the hair from uma and then you can switch with these buttons the hair and i will i will add a new text field with text mesh pro but i will put this before the panel and I will say hair and we will change the value to 20 and then we can drag and drop no we can't because the high of the text mesh pro And I will do this like this. And then we have to create a new panel. Oh no, we will create a UI text. And sorry, uh, not in the panel. We will create it in the customizer panel. So click on pen UI. And we will add a new text mesh pro text, and I will call it skin color. And I sh changed the size as well. And yeah, we need to change the box like this. And after, um, I will call this panel hair panel so we know what uh, is it is and we can we can type um hair text so we know what is what it is and i will change this one to skin color text and now we can add a new panel 
UI panel and I will do the same with the horizontal layout group and then we can add a new uh, no, we changed the height of the panel to 50 at first and I will add UI an image and yeah now we have an image here and yeah what I will do now is I will create a new folder and I call this U Uma because we need this and then I will import color table um, I will upload it so you can can get it uh, down below the video okay and now we have to do the texture type um, must be bright 2D and UI and we need to check uh, the read and write enable then we can apply and now we go to our image and we put the image to our source and now I will change yeah we can change the height to of the panel to 200 no it's too big 240 130 and then you have the skin color check uh, a box but um, for this one we need to create something later and yeah now this is okay and now we can duplicate this customization panel and I have to Switch the game scene down and now we have the left side and I will uh, put it to the to the right side so we will drag and drop it to the right side and let's check uh, how it looks when we start and as you can see we have to change it and I will change this by negating this and yeah as you can see if we uh, we can focus a little bit more on the UI so we have a, it in the middle and I call this customization panel um, right and now if we click on play we can see that we have a panel right and a panel left maybe we will um, size it in the next lecture or put it a little bit more up but uh, yeah we need to change this uh, to responsible in a later case okay and what I will do is I will go to the left side and I will delete everything on the left side without uh, this one and I will change the headline to um, character settings and yeah the last step we will do here now is to create right click um, on the panel and create a new panel so we add the horizontal stuff 
and we create this and now we create an high of 30 and we add two buttons so the first button will be 30 and we duplicate the button and we can change this to male and the other one to female so now we can we have a selection and yeah for now we can uh, create another button in the canvas and i will align it to the top because this will be our create character button i will change change it to create character button and create character okay in this case um we got all with our ui and yeah thank you for watching if you like my content you can leave a good comment or leave a like and yeah if you have any problems you can join my discord server and be someone of my community thank you for watching mm -hmm.